I'm Mir. I'm Sophie. Guys, today we are watching the beginning of the Hunger Games. We're gonna see how it all started. Make sure you smash that like button and comment and subscribe to join us on our journey. And guys, don't forget to look at our description for our Patreon. We have full length movie and show reactions, no sync required, and there's only one subscription to make it easier. So don't forget to check that out. And let's get right into it. dark days three years before the first annual hunger games this is given game of thrones oh wow when they said it was the dark days i didn't think it was like this the dog got rabies or something the freak why does this look like one of the um the arenas, Loki? Is the well, it looks like the the, the city. Poppins, he about to eat a person? Oh man, that is. This movie starting off crazy already. Your father is dead, oh, for Elenus. Wow. It was a rebel, they say, a trap. So this rebel stuff already was happening. It's up to us now to make him proud. So I remember someone said before Hunger Games, I thought they said it was like, I don't even know. I'm gonna have to just watch it. Oh, wow. So, okay, the districts definitely was already a thing. And the rebels. And the rebels, obviously, because some of the districts are poor, but. Tigress? Dang, how long was Tigress around? Right. Tigress, where's the shirt? That's definitely the, uh, we saw her before. This said three years before the Hunger Games. And we no, saw now he's older. You're right. Now he's older. Tigress? I'm sorry, I know I'm late, but look, I did it. I, I did something. Oh, that's before she looked like a tiger. I told Fabricia at work that she needed to bleach her white curtains, and I slipped the shirt in when I- Don't tell me that's snow. That's definitely snow. We, we know it is, like, come on, that gotta be. That'd be weird if it wasn't. Come see! Coriolanus Snow. Oh, I was right. president of Panam. Oh, wow. This is gonna be another Anakin Skywalker. I see what you're saying. It's the plinth prize, Tigers. We'll be able to pay the rent. Snow lands on top. I'm confused about the world because... No, no, no. If it's, if it's the, if it was just the dark days when he was a kid, what was happening? Hungry. Cook serve steak for breakfast. Get to throw half out. Shame on you, Corio. Don't you know that they're starving in the districts? I, I know we're talking a lot, but all I'm saying is, if all the districts were still a thing, right, and it was still poor districts and good districts, what? Like, the dark days mean, like, it all was falling apart? Like, even the capital and everything? Spill it. Who won the prize? Oh no, I'm not gonna ruin my father's big day. No one here actually likes him, but they do love his money. You know what that's like, don't you, Rackman? Oh my gosh. Oh, the same old song. So how did the reaping go now? Because right now, this beginning, I'm just trying to see what's going on. First of all, I'm surprised how fast in three years it was even able to build that type of technology to run the Hunger Games. Not anymore. I'm so sorry. What? And I was confused what prize they were talking about, too. Because as you can see now, he's saying it's a change. There's no prize. So something's changing right now. Suspicious day. I am Dr. Volumnia Gall. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I am honored to introduce to you the creator of the Hunger Games themselves, oh, Dean Casca Highbottom. What the heck? I just realized. That's Tyrion. Wait, is that him? Yes. I can't believe they still allow him to speak in public. And here sit. So they must not like him. Nobody likes him. I don't think nobody likes him. The Plinth Prize will no longer be determined by who has the best grades. Excuse me? But by who is the best mentor in the Hunger Games. That's fair, though. Oh, and I must tell you that anyone caught cheating to give their tributes an unfair advantage <laughs> will just have no future at all. <laughs> oh. Yo, okay, I get it now. Right, 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 right. Okay. His whole speech just summed everything up. 
in my opinion. I, I understand what's going on now. And I like how old everything looks, but it's still kind of like the future. It's kind of funny. It's weird. Girl goes to Palmyra Monte, District 2, boy. Boy goes to Jazz Plymouth. You got the pick of the litter. So people in the Capitol always, okay. Cause I never, we never watched it from the Capitol point of view. So this is kind of like interesting. Yeah, right. That's why I was a little confusing too. The rug girl, District 12. She belongs to Coriolanus Snow. Ah, uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> that's what you get. And that's why, why and we can tell right now, that's why he never liked District 12. Yeah, that's why he probably had, had an eye for Katniss in standouts, you know? People that stood out. You you get a you get a nice little prize because you got good grades. Yeah, actually prove that you're worth it by making the trip. No, I don't. Win. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. I don't. I actually think that was smart. I, I get it. I, I don't. I don't dislike what um that game creator did. And I like how he emphasized of like not making it unfair. Cause I mean, I don't like what he did at all. What the hell means? But. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Honestly. I think that win was crazy. I think they I think they drafted Lucy. Um they like tricked her or did something because everybody was laughing. You could take my paw. This is literally like Katniss, bro. Cause I think they're singing for her. She probably the Mockingjay. She was the first Mockingjay. You can't take my you can't take my talking. You can kiss my eyes! Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay. Wait a minute. That was something. Yeah, that's exactly what Katniss was like. She was the... And she literally bowed like that, too. That was, that was funny. That was actually funny because Katniss definitely did the "You're welcome." <laughs> yeah, and Lu well, now we know Lucy definitely was the first standout. Um, Clearly, I feel like District Twelve people always hated them. And the and, and the Capitol didn't know didn't even know what to do, so it was just like keep rolling because it's the first time they ever saw it. So yeah, look at you, your makeshift shirt and your too tight shoes, trying desperately to fit in. When I know the snows don't have a pot to piss in. Oh wow, the way he just described his 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 name made it seem like he's known for like not being that well off, and it, to me it gave off that they were actually well off. Like his father was like this name. Well, if you heard when he was talking to those people, like I guess those are his friends. They were talking about you can't buy class. Don't discount her just because she's district court. You might have more in common with her than you think. Tigress, per usual, speaking facts. Yeah, she was always on the good side. Wait, what am I talking about? Everything looks probably old because the whole world was falling apart. Duh. So all the materials and everything probably got messed up, so they need to rebuild everything again. Let's go. Move it. Excuse me, can I? They train them so badly. Look how old they trains look, though. That's what I'm trying to say. Hey! Oh, we got a runner. Oh, that's his opportunity. <laughs> this cage is delightful. Get him, Reaper. Oh. Yeah, that, Honestly. Yeah, yeah, that was probably not a good idea to. Reaper killed a peacekeeper back in 11. Well, I, I say we all kill him. I'm in. Okay. Yeah, that was not a yeah, good idea. Say, yeah. <laughs> they don't like you, capital people. No That is way. so rude. Okay, it seems like they treated them more like animals back in yeah. this time. Because they didn't do all this. They actually treat, treated them well. They treated them better, yeah. Who are you? Lucy Greyback. May I introduce you to my neighbors? Hello. It seems like Snow is really trying his hardest to do his job. Yeah, he is. But he seems genuine, too. We're musicians by trade, and we travel from place to place as the fancy takes us. At least, we used to. 
before the peacekeepers rounded us up. I see. But now you're District 12. If you say so. Yes. I like what she just did. <laughs> yeah. I like that. The game makers did tell you to jump in the cage with them. They didn't tell me not to. They just said that it was a mentor's job to introduce our tributes to the citizens of Pan Am. You could say Snow is doing this more for himself than for her because he wants to stand out too. But that's just my, I'm not saying that's what he's doing. I'm just saying you could say I that. I think it's two because I, I feel like he, this personally, it shows that Snow has a genuine side. Like he was doing it for himself. Like, of course you're going to do stuff for yourself, but he didn't have to extend himself out like that if he didn't want to. So that's where the genuine come. I feel like he does feel bad for them, honestly. I don't need your help, Sejanus. That the tributes are human beings, just like us. That's why nobody wants to watch the games. It's because people know, deep down, that winning a war 10 years ago doesn't justify starving people's children, taking away their freedoms, their rights. No fair. Whoa, 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 whoa. I like what that guy was saying. What that guy was just saying, well, he, he was, he was, he was, ba he was cooking real quick. Maybe Sejanus is onto something here. Maybe we should be viewing those tributes as human beings. I mean, you saw those kids in the zoo. They just, just wanted to get to know Lucy Gray. If we need people to watch, we should be letting them get closer to the tributes before the games. This okay. is so messed okay, up, so, yo. <laughs> okay, so Snow, so Snow had 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 the had, saw the future before everybody else saw it. I mean, the game maker, she kind of did too, because she was asking them. But Snow know what knows what people want. Yeah. So. If it'll help the ratings, why not? Coriolanus and I are class partners. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dr. Gall, we do all of our assignments together. <laughs> <laughs> it'll be an interesting test. <laughs> Viola. Bruh. Viola Davis, yeah, her acting is Bruh. top notch. Bruh. Now. I need to pause this a lot because yeah guys so it's gonna this, be a lot of talking like snow i feel like he's a 50 50. <laughs> now his friend now i'm liking the friend because <laughs> this is what the government do punishing people who have nothing to do with nothing and then on top of that they said that they won the war so what is the point of further doing that and that government's supposed to benefit everybody marcus look there i got some food for you <laughs> Here. He has the right attitude, but that's not how you go yeah, about it. Yeah, it sounded like he was trying to feed a dog. Come here, boy. Like, no. He didn't sleep a wink the whole journey because he was keeping the bats off me so I would get some rest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on, try already. Are you serious? <laughs> that is like, oh my gosh. This looks so bad. A chance to help you to make some suggestions to the game makers. I might even be able to get the audience to send you gifts in the arena. See, Snow, Snow, he was ahead of his game. Oh, ahead of his time. Ahead of his time, yeah. He, he was ahead. He knew how to work this whole thing. The guards say you get money if you get more people to watch, and you say you want to help me. Which is it? Both. Now that little, that right there, just summed up that, that this whole thing. Yeah, because, that's what I said. Because it could be both, but we'll see by the end of this movie which one it really is. If you get what I'm trying to say. <laughs> oh. Okay, I was okay. I didn't think she was gonna actually stab her. <laughs> Hold on, it's okay. I'll get help. Somebody help us, please. <laughs> There is no absolute way. There is no absolute way. They're savages, one and all. However they may smile, you must use her or you'll end up dead in the trees like your father. In the yeah. trees. So what, did he get hung or something? I don't know. Did his dad used to play the games? His dad was that probably. I don't know because his, the games wasn't the thing. So maybe in the war. The games was a thing. His dad was dead before the games. Really? I didn't mean to do that. I want you to win. It's Reaper, right? One thing Dean was uh, right about. Let me read you I don't. What, what the? 
my gosh. Why did he do that? <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> And that's exactly what I was just about to say. I think Dean is right. I don't think the capital should mentor these people <laughs> because they don't like them. And I think it was a good idea that they switched it to the tribute winners mentoring the people. <laughs> because, like, that is, like, they well, already... Well, maybe nobody should be in the games, period. Because, <laughs> like... What am I looking at? I guess the stuff that they use... The things they use in the games, 100%. I mean, she actually had to make them. But the sponsorships and the gifts in the arena, those were all mine. Clemmy. If you've handled their food, for example, or if they've inhaled the sweat of your palm on a page, they'll leave you alone. <laughs> That's her saying, you didn't write it, Basically. so stop lying. <laughs> Right, she's trying to take a lot of credit for Snow's... Retrieve it. Oh! Yeah. Oh, yep. Yeah. So what happens to the liars? I don't think her mother would be happy to learn how she caught this sudden... flu. Now run along, you have an arena to promote, and it's time for my milk and crackers. I mean, Clemmy, she dumb. It, she was better off just saying, like, I didn't write it. All that fear that she put in front of you, you still put your hand in. Come on. What was you trying to prove? You I don't know. That was... Um, she was not smart for that. But I love how the fact that this 10th Hunger Games, Snow is changing everything. Yeah. <laughs> like, he really changed everything, this 10th Hunger Games. And I guess that's the reason he's the... He was the president. Get that camera on her. Coral. Yo, they really did not care the way they look going into the games. Like how they do now. Well, in the future. They definitely didn't care. Which is bad on the marketing. Because exactly. Why would exactly. you have people going on TV looking like that? Yo, you're that's you're so right. Please. Please. I, I, I don't know. I don't even know what to say. Did like everybody in there just die? Right. I don't even know. I don't know what's going on. Help me. Like what? Bro. Yeah, I'm confused. Excuse me. Now she gonna help him. Oh, they getting shot. The freaking tributes did that. Some sort of rebels or something did that. Rebels? You think so? How? Because they just ran and said, he was like, we gotta go. He wouldn't help you. Because who else would just blow that up and give the people an opportunity to run? Is, my thing is like, how would, how would the rebels even be able to do that? That's what I'm saying. It was a rebel bombing. Oh, you just said. They must have been planning it for months. From District 12. Lucy, Ray, Baird, come out here with that guitar, you songbird. They still continue in it like it never <laughs> happened. Like, that is insane. The babe, I fell down in the hall. When I was a girl, I fell into your arms. We she getting a lot of donations. That's donations? Yeah. yeah. That's a lot. So who will you turn to tomorrow, I wonder? For when the bell on. rings... Love you run your own. It's empathy. It's 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 feeling bad for her. You know, it's yeah. people like that. And that's why Snow is was so smart and he changed the game because now you have these tributes that, oh, put them in cages, show they're different from us. No. Treat them you want you you want to feel for them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's what gets the money. That's what makes people want to watch. Even though I don't agree with the Hunger Games, it's clearly and working. she got the record high donations. See what happens when you do stuff? 
Now, I don't love your odds, but may they be in your favor. Thank you for being here. I just can't really fathom the fact that they the rebels only just blew that place okay, up. Okay, and like they okay. No, I'm talking about and it's still going. I'm oh, saying the f oh. I cannot. Bye -bye. Believe so I feel that. like this movie is trying to like side with the um I feel like they really try to make it seem like the rebels are bad. I mean they no, was doing that I'm even too, that. even when we was watching it with Katniss, but still. Well no. Jessup's my friend. No. The moment that bell rings, you can't trust anyone. Not even Jessup. Just lay low down there until it's safe to come out. Thank you for taking care of me. I can't let you die. Hmm. I don't know. He was pouring that rat poison into that thing, but like, I want to believe this so much. Oh. Wow. See, like, I want to believe that so much. I do, but it's I think something he's not that's used to that. yeah, it's something that's just like making me not want to believe it. Because why did he put that poison in that flask and then close it? I don't know if it was for that rat, so I don't know. My old boyfriend, Billy Tope, he was cheating on me with the mayor's daughter. The girl from the reef. Yeah, she got crazy jealous. She had her pa read my name up on that stage, and now everyone will know what they did to me. Oh, that's what happened. Right, that's why he did that. That's, yeah, that's why, why she did that. That's why she did that with the snake. What's in here? Don't touch it. Don't even breathe it in because small amounts can be deadly. We all do things we're not proud of to survive. Oh wow, so okay, he gave her that to help her. So he actually does believe in her and wants her to be okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to be really, I'm trying to really believe it, you know? Oh, I was about to say like, what, the movie over? <laughs> <laughs> that would've been insane. Okay, so that was the, that was part one, the mentor. So now we're on the prize. This is so different from how it is in the future, yeah, bro. Very, it's so freaking you can tell old how, yeah. and they don't even know what they're doing it right now. <laughs> like they're still getting used to things. Like remember, when your tribute dies, get out of here. So when your tribute dies, you get out of here. <laughs> that's insane, bro. And that's crazy. So the mentors watched the well, I guess that always been a thing. The mentors watch the games, right? Yeah, it just didn't seem like that. It didn't yeah, they didn't have it set up like that though. And they didn't go in like that either. And the fact that this they arena is right. like the fact that this arena is like destroyed is some symbolism about that now. It has to be. Because it was a good it was like a nice little arena setup, but now it was all messed up. Maybe oh maybe that was the start of Snow him starting the Hunger Games and how it really destroyed humanity in a lot of ways. Like or how the he... games or he really destroyed the games. Yeah. Right. Like, look how they look how it's all set up. Like, they don't rise up. They get they just walk in. That's what I'm saying. How did that technology stuff happen? Because that was some advanced stuff. Yeah, a lot of advanced technology happened in the next. Yo, she's already dead. They caught him. The monsters! All of you! Wow. That looks like how do people watch that? This is real people dying. <laughs> so these games must not last long. Bro, I'm about <laughs> to say it right. I don't think these games last long. <laughs> it don't even seem like they leave this arena. I don't think they do. And I thought they were, but I guess now they I'm looking at it. They all just try to slaughter each other. <laughs> Dad, this is crazy. Oh my God. Oh, oh. I'm not gonna lie. This Hunger Games is more intense it for is. some reason because it's, it's, it's more, uh, it's just so basic. It's just straight up fighting. And like, where do you even run? Here comes the pack. Surprising high assault. <laughs> Waiting with a brick. And just like Katniss, Lucy there after her. Seems like she's kinda like by her own with Jessup and everybody. And Jessup is like Peter. In yeah. a sense. In a sense. Please, if you're going to vomit, do it off camera. Thirteen tributes remain. Reaper still looming large at the top of the charts. <laughs> this don't seem Nowhere near as entertaining because they don't even last long. Of course, they lose in viewers. Definitely not as entertaining. You're right. It's definitely more brutal. 
because it's so fast and so like <laughs> you yeah. just straight up just beating people up. No high tech. Like when are they, when is she gonna when are the, the all the uh, animals and creatures gonna be added? You know, it, it probably don't even get to that point. He's not even dead. I thought he was dead. He's still alive. The way the guy stormed off, I thought he was dead. Is she about to kill him? <laughs> wow. Whoa. That is like... That's the weather. Was it mercy? Was it murder? My man doing the weather report and reporting the death of people at the same time. Yo, them drones. Yo, them drones. <laughs> first of all, that almost. First of all, that almost Yo. swiped her head off. What was it called? The donations. What Gifts? was it called? No, it was called something. But yeah, they suck. Yo, like they. Yo, that's horrible. Even when you try to give them donations, they're it's terrible. It's hard <laughs> to even do. Even if Lucy Gray Baird somehow wins it all. I will do everything in my power to ensure that you don't see a dime. So, ask yourself, how much do you care if she lives now? Wow, that was what? just that was just straight up like I don't know what he's trying to do. That just seems I like I feel hate. like he don't like him. Yeah, because maybe he's not even supposed to be in the um in the capital. You see how he said like it seemed like he's even forcing himself to fit in. I don't think he's he was meant to like either. I need someone to get him out right now. You should send peacekeepers in. You still want that plinth prize, don't you? I'll freeze the feed for an hour. I estimate that's all we have until the people notice. Okay, so he clearly want that plinth prize. Get him out, kill him. Like, how how's it gonna go? Like, that's how you go get him out. And who he about to go kill again? The guy that was upset about Marcus dying. I forgot his name, though. Start with an S. Sejanus? Yeah. He got to go kill his friend, practically. He said get... She said get him out, but I feel like he's going to have to kill him. But this is so crazy. The fact yeah, that they're sending was, him in the arena, yeah, like, what? Yeah, I was about to what? say, because those... The, the players could just kill him. Easily. Two beats kill you in here. She's just gonna say you died of the flu. Yeah. Oh, you need to decide. Yo, she, yo, she woke up fast. Yeah! Go, go. That was overall. It just was not a good plan. Like, why would you set the? First of all, how did he even stay in there that long? And he, they are not running away. They are you they are running all... away from the exit. I don't wanna hurt you! Oh my goodness, bro. Oh my goodness. Ooh, this is this this is definitely more aggressive. It is. Cause I may have missed you tonight. But your songbird's next on my list. Let's go. Oh, my goodness. It's, like, so personal and close up, and, like, it's just so different, bro. If anything, it seems more modern and not, like, high in technology, you know? Yeah. I had to do something. <laughs> yeah, they, they just killed him. They did? Yeah. They killed him? Yeah, he, that's why the guard just made that that head notion. Eviction. Why would they have an eviction? I thought they had a lot of money. They did not have a lot of money. That's why I said I thought wrong. I killed one of the tributes. <laughs> Awful. It was. And it felt. Powerful. Mm. Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> he th he definitely felt some. Yeah, that's why he kept going. Like first he stopped and then he kept going. Yep, hit him a second time. 
Damn. Boom! Okay. <laughs> Yeah. Yo, my man Jessup is about to turn into a, a animal or something. Like, what is going on? Oh, yeah. Rabies, it makes you afraid of water. Send him a drone. Scare him. Yes. Away from her. I mean, that's true. I did not know that. I did actually know that rabies uh it makes you scared of water. Don't ask me why. Where are you going? <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, no, dang, that's horrible. I didn't think it was going to be like that. Yo, <laughs> this is like... Yeah, that was a hard fall. That definitely could have, might have just killed him. Sleep. Oh, my. Sleep. Um, that looks very... Oh, uh, stop. Yeah, that looks horrible. Dang, she listened to him in her tribute. Uh, he I was done already. He has rabies. I know, but... Rabies, you can't cure it, by the way. Once you have rabies, you're basically dead already. Don't ask him why I know that. Just stay right there. <laughs> he has to do something now. Yeah. I mean, they kind of help, but, um... Oh, gosh. Okay, they, they help. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, dumb drones are, like... They're horrible. They're, they do the complete opposite. He's I'm just sending water. <laughs> do it now. Would you about to put that powder in there? Yes, if she puts that poison powder in that in the in the water, that's that's great. But then what what is she gonna like, you know? Possibly give it some or switch it out. <laughs> she can't fight, she just swing her. Lucy Gray, on the move, and so is Pop Harrington. Thank you, Pop. <laughs> like, yo, he doesn't make anything better. Oh, that, oh, that hurts. You're useless. <laughs> I hate leaders like that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I, I kind of saw that coming. And I think they're just going to end up killing each other and then one of them's going to drink it. They're probably going to kill each other. But uh, whoever drinks that is done anyway, so. And honestly, I don't care who drinks it. <laughs> because in my opinion... Lucy, please don't stop her. Just let her drink it. Yeah, I feel like she already suffering. Right, just let her drink it. I, I'm just being honest. Like, right. I think it's better for her to go out like that than... Yeah. <laughs> Sadly. Oh! I didn't think it was gonna be that fast. Wow. Yo! Yo! When I jump where? Jumped at that girl. Ah! Whoa, whoa, are they from District 11? Cause that's like, like, that's 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 like, Right, like what? What are y'all? What are y'all? <gasps> yeah, I did everything. Like, like, like that's the thing that y'all shocked about. Like, <laughs> out of here, bro. That was such like so dram so dramatic. Yo. He just tore the flag down. Now y'all breaking down. Like, oh my gosh. Are you going to punish me now? Yep. Ooh. Yep. He was punished. Son of our beloved president has this morning succumbed to his injuries sustained in the rep- You were right. I didn't think they were gonna kill him. A rainbow of destruction will engulf our arena, even if it means there's to be no victor in these games. <laughs> okay, it's that's not funny, but it's, it's just like- It's the fact that she killed him. Right. Just how insane what she just said was. And the, and the dad had to know too, right? Probably. That's I thought well, that was care. the dad. I thought that was, but that's like... I know, but I'm just saying, like, it's so crazy, though. Like, they really didn't care about him. She is not fond of the district people. <clears throat> this might hurt. Doing surgery or whatever that is, I'll... No... You, you see what Snow is trying to do, right? Yeah. You see what he's trying to do, right? 
I'm just making sure. Here, buddy, buddy, buddy. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, but that was just so like, like that was so uh, just abrupt. Like, yo, they really trying to murder her. Was that a note he put in there? I don't know. It was it was something that Lucy could use. Oh, right. Oh, 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 on his on their face. Oh, oh, she just killed you, bro. It went all over his face. Yeah. All over uh, his nose and stuff. She to give it to all of them, though. Did Coral do something to treat? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Snakes. Oh, my gosh. The snakes. The snakes. Oh, remember they remember the snakes. Remember what she said about like um somebody you can trust, like how the snakes won't attack you if it can trust you. Okay, and he probably put like his blood or something in it. Remember he he went like this on the yeah, napkin. Yeah, some he did something. Okay, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Wobi. <laughs> Wobi. Oh wow. Wobi. Oh. oh gosh, that's horrible. That was. Gosh, that's horrible. Oh my gosh, they so fast. Oh, he accepting it. Yeah, that's insane. Now, all colors lead to gray. I don't think they're going to attack her. He put that note in there. <laughs> She's won. Wait, did she win? She's the only one left, yeah. She's won, let her out. Fred, that's not your call to make, Mr. Snow. Did she not win? Right, she was the only one. Remember what she said though? She said all the victors, she said everybody's gonna die because the president's son died. Remember she said that? That's that's dumb. I didn't think she really meant that. I thought that was just her her mm. like threatening the fact that she could do that. I didn't think she really mean she really no, meant that. The minute you saw the snakes, you didn't think like it was over. Well, it don't matter because the snakes not gonna attack her anyway. Because Snow did something. He did something. Yeah, because look how close that snake is. I mean, as long as Dr. Gall don't know, like, he put a note in there, because, like, you know what's going to happen to him. But we know Snow clearly doesn't die yet. There's definitely a theme with the snakes, though, because she put she she put a snake in that girl's uh shirt in the beginning, and she's wearing stuff with snakes on it. So yeah. I like how they did that. Right here in the old air before. Come on, she good? I feel like she's gonna die. Yeah, it's but it's, it's a lot of movie love. It's given like she's gonna die, and, yeah, this, and this is gonna be a canon event for Snow. Doctor Gall, please get her out. Get her out. <laughs> okay, yeah. I wasn't expecting everybody else to say get her out. <laughs> that caught yeah, me off guard. Like, that's insane. <laughs> like, come on now. That caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting Tigers to scream that. <laughs> How much time do she have Get though? Out. Oh, all right. Oh, but they put, you know, they put them, they put that person as the winner, but. <laughs> but then I think he took it to the head, you know? Well, we gotta see, cause. Mm, I like that they doing this though. That it doesn't just end. Well, we know, cause Hunger Games never ended when the game ended. <sighs> yeah. I warned you, Mr. Snow. Cheating will be punished. Okay. They caught my boy. They caught my mm. boy, Snow. President Raven still has left your form of punishment to me, and I've decided banishment to the districts where you'll serve your capital in exile for the next 20 years as an anonymous peacekeeping grunt. The sound of snow falling. Ha, I get it, because his name is Snow, and he's fallen, and you're punishing him. I get it. Dang, that was yeah. okay. That was so abrupt. That was so like fast. So just his... straight up punishment. Just send him to be a peacekeeper. That's crazy. For 20 years. For 20 years. Yo, mom, we were really seeing this man's story, bro. After what I did in the arena, my father had to buy the academy a brand new gym just so I could get my diploma. They lied to us. 
Like they do. Like so, they always do. Yeah. Of course. Duh. Why didn't I think of that? That's the president's son. Of course they're not just going to kill him. Oh, I want, I was going to say that at the end. Because I thought I was gonna, that's crazy that they killed him, but wow. My friend, don't give them the satisfaction. Your life has just begun. You're going to do great. We're both going to do great. Just be careful. Okay. So what does the tributes get for winning, by the way? Oh, the tributes. Yeah, I don't know. Because, like... Right, they said that Snow won, but he wasn't the actual tribute. And he was going to win the prize money. Run, dude! Run! Run, dude! Run, dude! Oh, what the heck? No! Yo, did you hear the Jabber Jays repeat him after yeah. you just died, bro? I don't think I would have been able to shoot her. Would you? You need to find a way to make peace with our life here now. Or have your father buy you a discharge and do something else. I get where, uh, what's his name? Snow? No. Oh, the other guy? Yeah, I get where, I get where uh, the other guy is coming from. I, I get it, but Snow is kind of right in this situation only because he went to this place to find what? Find Lucy Gray. No, the other oh, guy. Oh, the other guy. He went there to try to make a change. Right. And when you're faced with harsh reality, what, you just, you got to do hard stuff sometimes when you're faced with harsh reality is what I'm trying to say. Even if you want to make a change. Now, how about a song, huh? She looked like she has better clothes on. Yeah. So maybe she did get some sort of award. Nothing you could take from me. Ever worth. I ain't gonna lie. Snow loves her, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yo, he lo yo, he loves her. He loves her so much. And that's probably why he hates Katniss so much. That's her ex. Definitely her ex. Looks like he been drinking a little bit. Yeah. <clears throat> you saw everybody just start fighting, though? Keep your hands off me right now. <laughs> Oh, That's what I'm saying. Everybody just fighting out of nowhere. Gloria, stop! Oh, get off! Get off! What are you afraid to come on? We got you. Yo, he was about to. Snow was about to beat him to death. Basically. That's what it was looking like. She's here. She's alive. <clears throat> Interesting. I kind of don't want this to end. I literally want this to, I want to see this man grow up all the way to where he becomes. I think they're going to, I really hope they do that. I really hope they come out with another movie then. I feel like they definitely did put like the parts in, in one movie though. I just didn't think he would love a person like. He like, had kids. He had a granddaughter, remember? But they never show his wife or his own daughter. He probably did. He probably just didn't know his, his family was there. This is exactly where Katniss was. It looked like it. I didn't have a choice. That little girl, too. I know. I thought it'd be one of the others, maybe hey. cool. You are not a killer, Lucy Gray. Yes, I am. I mean, she kind of is a killer. I mean, she was trying to kill the others, but it wasn't intended. But you can tell she didn't want to be in there anyway. <laughs> Hey man, that's so crazy though. Like when you're dating something, you really gotta do it in secret. Yeah, I'm very intrigued. I, I gotta see. I gotta see this play out. Are you trying to help these people? Don't you think they need help? They lost the war, Sejanus. A war they started. That made your family rich. Mm. They both have different perspectives. They, right, I was about to say they both got a point. They both have very valid points. Not even gonna lie. But I don't think. I don't think Snow should be like... That's what I'm saying. We have to know how the war started because nobody would rebel unless they're in a bad position. That's why to me it's like regardless, the capital was always in, was always the, the aggressors in the situation. Because nobody's going to rebel if everybody's at peace. To the middle of the plane and further there. What if he get caught with her and then they kill her? And that's what makes him mad. I don't know. Something's gonna, gonna, gonna happen. Something, yeah. Something is, that's exactly what I meant by played out. Cause I gotta see this. I like, it's all lovely right now, but we know this man does not turn out to be lovely. What if this was our life, Coriolanus? Out here, 
catching our own food, living out by a lake. I mean, would you still feel a need for the capital even then? Right, that is true, because Snow wants power, you know? It seemed like that's, that's the other side that I'm trying to see if it's going to come out. Like when it's gonna come out? Cause we know that's what that you know what yeah. I'm saying. Man, he he <laughs> in the very beginning he was wondering if he was gonna get that money. You right. know what I'm saying? Is he, that's who he that's who he's always been. But Katniss has a much handsome ring, don't you? Excuse excuse me. How? Wait 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 wait. How? What? Wait 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 wait. Some people call it swamp potato, but I think Katniss has a much nicer ring, don't you? No. No, 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 no. That is weird. That is weird. I don't like that. So, okay. We got to really see this play out. I don't like that. It's not like it's going to hit him right now. Katniss is not even alive but, yet. But right, but it's the fact that we... <sighs> this person that... That's not even alive affects him so much in the future later. And even her name hurts him. <laughs> You can trust me. I promise you that. If you can trust anyone in this world, you can trust me. You can trust me too. Mm, mm. Trust. Yeah, that's, yeah. Trust. Let's see if you can is really. Is he getting in trouble? I, I think he is getting in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to reassign you to officer training in District 2. You'll earn a real wage. You'll never see anyone from District 12 again. <laughs> Yeah. That's not what you wanted. Yeah. I'm gonna be home soon. I promise her. He's being pulled. He's being pulled two ways. Yeah. His well, no, he always wants to go back to the capital. Like, come on, let's be for real. That's why I say he's being pulled. So he gonna have to tell that girl. He just told her she can trust him. I think maybe if he's honest with her and tells her, but I don't think he's gonna do that. That are getting out of District Joke. 12. Stop talking. I can't hear Listen this. Listen to me. They're going up north to start a new life <sighs> far away from Pan Am. Yeah, this, yeah, Snow, he's getting pulled in a lot of different directions. He's trying his to His friend, help. his family, and his, the girl. He's recording him. Of course he's recording him. Because what you're doing, it, it, it can have some really bad results. It's really dangerous to do something like that. It's worth the risk to do the right thing. For you, your father will just buy your way out of it like he always does. While I'll be hung just for knowing you. He has a point. I feel like Snow has a point. Do you think he has a point? Do you, do you think mean, he has a point? he's purposely doing it. Yeah, right, but like, yeah. He's purposely he's, doing he's it. He's purposely because... doing it. So where is he going to send that bird to? I don't know, but... Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. To the general. Yep. Dr. Gall. It's still crazy, though, because what he's doing is treason, too. You know what? That's what I'm saying. He picking and choosing. Snow he is picking, picking and choosing picking because and choosing Lucy for, for would agree. his best way out. Lucy would agree with what that friend is doing. Of course. She would agree, and he doesn't like it. It's like everything that he's doing, it ultimately comes down for himself. I'll say that. Hey, part of the deal. Hey, 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 stop. What are you doing? Guns, Sejanus? I didn't know there was going to be weapons, Corio. They lied to me. What do you expect? And this is what this is the part of Snow that I understood. Because it's dangerous doing something like that. This could start a war. Like, you're not thinking. You're letting people yeah. free. Like, everything's just supposed to be good. Like, oh, yeah, I'm going to let you free. My pa's going to string hey. y'all up. Ooh, for this no, she'll tell everyone, you idiot. Yeah, that's the mayor's daughter. No, 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 Oh my god! Yo, what the? If I'm gonna swing for this, you swing with me. Oh my goodness. Okay, I swear, I swear, I swear. Go, go. Get rid of these guns. Go. I, 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 I. We're brothers. Brothers. So whatever you've done, I, I swear I will keep you what? safe. Oh man, I don't know. Like Snow, he always thinks one step ahead, and that's why I felt like I was on his side because he saw his friend trying to help these people out, but is is not gonna end up well. 
He's trying to go all peaceful, but that's not how the world works. Now they're looking for the guns to see who did it. Are you okay? The mayor's going to get me killed, Cornelius. He already thinks it was me. That is true. Just wanted to say goodbye. I'll come with you. There was no point in him killing the mayor daughter, though. She was gonna talk. She was about to had get all of them in trouble. Every single person in that room. Only because, was only because he popped up there. She was. I fought for the capital during the war. I've been angry, but this is the first. Oh, they got both. They got him. They got both of them. Get the other she, one up she, here. She was there too. Wait, wait, did he just say get the other one? Yeah, I think they bring a Lucy Gray. I'm not gonna lie. To you. Who is this? Is oh, the that's the. Yeah. I'd expect this of a rebel, but not from one of our own. This is treason, plain and simple. Oh! He told on his friend! You know what? I forgot he sent that to him. So, the whole time, he did this on purpose. This whole time. He went. Oh yeah! There. I, oh yeah! He was lying to him when he was like closed up and saying like, "Oh, I'm your friend." Like, of course. He, yeah, that, he did that on purpose. He he yeah. straight up lied to him. But, I forgot. Uh, you know what? Because at first it did seem oh like what is going. Yeah, he did it on purpose. I forgot. So he can. Yeah. I feel like he's gonna lose Lucy too. He went in there, killed the mayor's daughter, killed the boyfriend. He only did that because he saw his friend wasn't wasn't going to stop, but it was still crazy. And it gave him an opportunity to become president once he go back to the capital. Strange things did happen. Yo, he's always been a slick person, yo. Literally. Like Snow. He always been slick. He's always been slick. It's like insane. Are you coming to mm. the tree? No, oh, bro. I just don't know how I feel about it. I don't know. My emotions are all over the place. Yeah, I don't know. Snow is a gray character. Yeah, he's very gray. He's very gray, and that's what I don't like about it. But, like, even in the last <laughs> movie in The Hunger Games, when he basically was telling Katniss, like, he wasn't even the enemy and how it was the other lady the right. entire time. He said, but he still did a lot of stuff yes. that was, like... Well, what interest was you really in? Because if you knew the other lady was playing all that, why did you not do anything about it either, you know? What? The person you killed, Corey Lanus, he said you killed three people. I only know about two. Do not lie to me. Who's the third? My old self. Who's I killed him so I could come with you. Oh. I mean, I hope he's telling the truth. Though. He's not telling the truth. Who's the third person he killed? His friend. Oh. Cause he said he killed his old self, but did he really? I don't think he did. He's about to kill Lucy. <laughs> now that would be insane. Why would he kill Lucy? Well, I don't know, but what is he pulling out a gun already for? And with that type of gun, is even more insane. Remember, he said he felt power from killing people. He does. He probably feels it just by holding a gun. You can go back home. Will you? No more the sense. Besides me. He gonna shoot her, bro. No way. He just said no more loose ends. You wouldn't tell anyone? Of course not. No. I don't like this. He's gonna shoot her. No. So was this start like no, I didn't him want not the, trusting her? Of course they don't. <laughs> I didn't want this to happen. I thought they actually was gonna trust each other, but they don't. They don't trust each other at all. Not Pete. They died. They cut his hair, but dyed it like white. That was the scarf he gave her. Ah! 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 Oh! Oh my goodness! Did she do that? She clearly. She did. definitely did. Lucy Gray! I said, are you trying to kill me? After everything I've done for you. Here's the breakdown. Yep, basically. Ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> and that's this... how a villain is born. And that's why he ate Katniss. Because the last thing she said she was going to do is pick some Katniss. Remember? He killed his friend. 
he was contemplating about staying here and not going home for her. It was like she was the thing that could have pulled him and kept him from not becoming what he's going to become. Right. But... He probably was going to go about the games in a smarter way, too. And that's why he hate District 12. <laughs> you know what's crazy? Because I wanted to say how everything comes back to love. Right. Everything is always about it love. It always has to do with love in a person. Did he, did he kill her in one shot? <gasps> Shut up! The fact that they got somebody that could definitely be like a... That looks just like Kim Conda. Because I could see him when he get yeah. older looking just like that. How yeah. President Snow looks. Like literally oh, he, just they like They did it. do good. They did great. Well. Um, <clears throat> that was a bad relationship ending. That was not a good note. Definitely not a good note. That they ended off on. Quite impressive. Mm. How you sent your only friend to the noose. Just to get my attention. That's not what I did. Are you sure? Because I think that won you the plinth prize, after all. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of what you did. And it's crazy, like, that he doesn't, like, accept that. And we need the Hunger Games to remind us all who we truly are. And who are you, do you determine? The victor. Welcome home, Mr. Snow. Mm. So the Hunger Games are there. Basically to show how us naturally as human instinct, what we would really do. It, it, it literally, like you said, survival of the fittest. And he is the victor. He is the, survi he is the survival of the fittest. <laughs> I don't want to agree with it because it's so bad. It is bad. It's so bad. When I sobered up, I wanted to destroy it. But your father, my best friend, he'd stolen it from me. Put both our names on it, taking it to Gaul to rise up himself. Mm. Right, rem reminding him of him. That's why why he don't like his son, and his son is like the same exact thing. I tried to stop them, however I could, but then you came along. Now the blood of so many more generations will be on my hands, because you've shown us the price people are willing to pay for a good show. Mm. Wait, that's crazy. Because he definitely was saying that the whole movie. Yeah. Huh? He was like, well, I mean, the game's my diet. <laughs> like, he was saying it so nonchalantly. I didn't believe him, but he really meant it. He really didn't want the games to continue. This is, you know, I got to read the books. I got to <laughs> read the books because, bruh. What, what is that? Bro, I was about to say, I that, saw those three things in his thing. Is that going to kill him? I think so. <laughs> Goodness, no is yeah. I think he he didn't know that. I don't think he did. Hmm. Yo, that's crazy. Snow is crazy. Hmm. And those two scenes it showed us the what the games are really meant for, and then how Snow views them, and the symbolism behind it. You know. Not just that, also how. The how the cousin was saying to Snow how she don't want him to become like her dad, like his dad. And the whole time he probably didn't even know that his dad did all that, you know? But destroy us. I ain't gonna lie. This was crazy. I'm surprised it had a low rating. Mm. <laughs> now, let me say this. I hope that this had more movies coming. Hmm. I mean, I hope this had more movies. Also, <sighs> let me also say how, okay, let me talk about my dislikes first because my dislikes aren't really that long. I would say that um, hmm. for the movie, you saw how they showed us the parts like, oh, this and this. I feel like they didn't have to put it all in one. A part of me feel like they didn't have to put it all in one. Okay, so like you, you, what you usually say is it could have been more in detail. They could have yeah. split it up. Okay. Okay. That was like my main thing. Other than because I feel like I still want to know. <laughs> like, I still want to know what everything before. before. Yeah. Because I feel like now we're learning mm -hmm. how Snow's dad 
is the reason why the games even exist. <sighs> I mean, they exactly they explained they explained it literally at the last minute like that. So it was kind of a, a surprise to me because I believe Dean. I really believe that he did it, but. And in reality, him, he didn't want to do it at all. And, and I was saying it was just how, a joke to him. And I was saying I I think that's why he also didn't like him because I feel like he's seen traits of his dad. He's seen it. He's seen traits of his dad. I mean, Dean seen traits of Snow's dad in him, and that's why he was trying. Because at first, I'm like, dang, like why are he being all like that, you know? But now I'm like, you know what? He's doing all that because he sees the the same energy that his dad had and why the games didn't even existed. So that's really crazy. And just mm. think about how him and um Dean and Snow's dad were like best friends. And Snow and the and the Snow and the friend were cool. And the friend was trying to stop him. Look what happened to his friend. He was trying to stop it, but the blame ended up being on him, especially after like the dad died. But all I'm saying is that I wish that it start from like the beginning, beginning. Like, like yeah, what yeah, even yeah, enticed? Yeah, yeah. No, I don't want to use the wrong word. What got Snow's dad to be? Oh yeah, let's create a Hunger Games. Like, I know we learned the meaning, but I wanted to see everything that led up to the wars because I feel like the way that they're still talking about everybody in the districts mm-hmm. is like they was always bad, and it's like no, that's not true, you know. <laughs> so I wish the movie started there because when they showed snow when he was a little kid it fast forward to like he was like 18 19 and it's like dang like that's a big gap hmm. that we're missing like we don't even know how his dad died and we don't barely know anything about his mom so i feel like if we saw a lot of that like even before snow was even born that would have been like a good first half and then the second half i wouldn't have mind if it was like part of him wanted to go to university because he wants to be president, yada, yada, yada. Right. The way he got built up to being uh, <laughs> under Dr. Gull's wing was so weird because if you watch half of the movie, you wouldn't think that's where he would end up because of how... Because yeah, the passion for the games and making it actual... Cause Gull literally said, I'm taking your advice. Yeah. He is the literal reason... That the games was even are even continuing in the first place right. because if they it was wasn't for him, stop. they were right. gonna stop because nobody was watching them. So clearly, in the first half, yeah, showed the passion. But once he saw Lucy and met her and was seeing, you know, what I'm saying what how they were being treated and what they were going through, seeing them as people, I really believed that Lucy could grab him and pull him away and be like, okay, I still want some sense of power, but Maybe I can go down this path. It was the path was like lighting up a little bit. I feel but like he was doing both. It was yes, he was doing both, but I, the path lit up to this way. But what and I'm he saying, he went down the other way. But I'm saying he never, he never like completely disliked the games. He wanted the games to be more. How do I call it? Wanted it to be more um, classified. And more organized. But I don't think he ever wanted to, like... I don't think he ever wanted to... He clearly never wanted the games to stop. Snow never wanted the games to stop. Yes, he saw the the people from the districts as people. But that was him using it as an idea to try to get the games to go longer. You're right. So that's what I'm saying. He was doing both. It wasn't like, oh, yeah, like, I he want the games both. to stop. And from the beginning, he always said he wanted power. He said he wanted to be the president. But, but that's why I said pull him away. I didn't say he wasn't doing both. I was just saying maybe Lucy could have pulled him more over to the side. And I kind of was believing it when he was looking at her and and they, and they was, you know, I guess you could say falling in love. But I really got caught off guard at the end with Lucy. I don't know why because I'm really not surprised that she didn't trust him. But I kind of got caught off guard of it. But it, it did give us little hints. Argue. It did give us little hints of it because you saw their little disagreements they was when he was talking about the Hern games. He was like... He says something, and no, she clearly didn't agree about he something said, he said. No, he's n- when she expressed it, he was like, "No, I don't think the hang the um the torture." Like he said, he don't think that is right, but he didn't necessarily try to make it seem like he's completely against it. Lucy says something like with a little attitude, and she was like, 
Yeah, she said something. She did, but that's what I'm saying. But like I saw I don't it, know. but I, I, I was just kind of surprised. Like, wow, they didn't talk it out. She just completely was like, nope, I don't trust him because he seems like he did. He the he is not understand our point of view a, as much as I thought he did. <laughs> I feel like. He saw Lucy and fell in love with her because he just genuinely liked her, but I don't think that was going to change the overall fact of what he wanted what to he do. What he wanted. Like, I feel like he... Because yeah. he was talking about, well, what if you came back with me to the Capitol? And she was like, well, yeah. why not just live out here? Why not just he live didn't out want here? that. He wanted That's what to I meant, go, right. He wanted what he wanted with Lucy and what he wanted with being in charge and all that. Then the other part was also, <laughs> I feel like when he got his rage from when he killed the first person. I feel like that really built it up, too. Because yeah, this thing about this whole last minute of saying, oh, the whole point of Hunger Games is to remind us of who we are. He likes the idea, like, he feels power yes, in killing people. And definitely... he knows, like, that's their natural instinct. And I feel like ever since mm-hmm. he killed the first person, he felt good. And it further up, you know what I'm saying? That's definitely Built how he... his rage for that. Yes, that's how he definitely felt. I agree. You're right. But the story was very interesting. Like, I didn't think... I didn't think him and Lucy was going to end up like that. I thought they were just going to have, like, a bad argument. But the way she left, I'm not going to lie, that's bad. That's why it surprised me. It is me. bad. Because, it surprised right, me. It surprised I get, me. I was like, wow, she I just I get left. you might be mad at someone, but not having closure, that's what that's, further... That's, I feel like that's yeah. what further made Snow go insane, especially with Katniss. Like, especially during that whole thing. But I hope they come out with more movies, too, because I feel like... After watching the Hunger Games that we watched, it's like everything he was saying to Katniss is like, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. He's still such a gray character. Because when he's talking to Katniss, he's like, well, I didn't really plan all this whole time. It was that lady because she's trying to do this, this, and that. It's like, Snow, like, what do you actually really want? Well, we you know? know we, yeah. It's, well, it's a lot. Know. That's what well, I felt like. We know he, he wants power, but like in the movies we watched with Katniss, he, we, we know he... he uh, he, he he tells them it's a fragile government. It's very fragile. It's very sensitive. Like a, a, the little slither of of hope can be, you know what I'm saying. He learned that with Lucy. Lucy was singing. She was this and that. She was giving them hope, and all this crazy stuff was happening just from just from this girl in District Twelve. Yeah. And he learned his lesson. To him, to to his point of view, you know what? to his point of view, he learned. That's him learning a lesson, being like, oh. I can't I can't mess with I can't mess with that and I'm gonna use that knowledge of what I learned to use that and building up the capital and making the games over and over and over again. Cause as we saw with Katniss, he didn't he didn't play around. He doubled down. He was like, We gotta get rid of her. Well And remember he said we, we gotta get rid he... of all her his species. Remember he said species? He was like, We gotta get rid of all the species too. Cause they're giving the people hope and last time that happened, it's gonna mess everything up. That was his reasoning. We know his reasoning of why he was doing stuff. But the thing is, Lucy wasn't even doing too much. Like, yeah, she won, <laughs> exactly. but she went back. Like, she wasn't listen, doing too much, but it don't back. matter. No, it was a little he just bit. Mad. He just mad because she didn't trust him. That was the whole point. Because when Lucy went back, just based on what happened after she won... It didn't seem even super crazy. Like, she wasn't really trying. It was really his friend that was really trying to do change. She was just, she looked like she just went back to her district and wanted to continue to live her life the way she wanted. So that's where I still get confused because it's like, he's the one who used, like, Luton, uh, he's the one who used Lucy's natural character for a way to build up the games. Like, she wasn't trying to, like, necessarily stop the games. Like, she was scared. She even, like, you know, she was just going through with it. So it's still crazy how at the end of the day, the way Snow went about with, especially with all the other girls in District 12, because I'm pretty sure ever since that one girl, he felt like it scarred him from anybody coming from District 12. That's a girl. That's why ever since then, I think no girl Victor ever won. He probably was killing them all off, like making sure. And then when Katniss come along, it just reminded him of who he really, of who he liked. Those characteristics is what made him do that to Katniss. Because it's not like Katniss wanted that for herself. Hmm. And I doubt that he saw that coming. Like, come on now. He didn't see Katniss Everdeen. 
But history always repeats itself at the end of the day, too. That's why I said, like, I feel like if we had more backstory, too, right, I need maybe more backstory. that would relate. I need more backstory. That would, because the way they was calling Katniss the Mockingjay, it was like, well, who was the previous Mockingjay before her? I need, I need more background, and I see why people rated this movie how they rated it. Not to say it was a bad movie, but I see, I think people only rated it the way they did because they, I felt like they needed more. Yeah. I expected it to be more. <sighs> Sorry, guys. Even when That's it was I'm first saying. starting, I expected it to be way more. They left but out a lot of details. I can just tell. All we can hope for is for Suzanne to come through. She didn't write a book after this? No. She just wrote this book in 2020. Oh, wow. She's probably writing <laughs> another one right now. Hopefully. That's why I saw all we can do is hope for Suzanne. Yeah. She to better come not. Through. She better not pull a. What's his name? J. George R. 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 Martin. Yeah. Yeah. Talking to you. How about you go finish Winds of Winter? How about that? <laughs> go finish the book. You just probably sitting around. So, all right. We will see y'all on the next one. Perfect. Perfect.